breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, on behalf of my partner, no, my dear partner, Professor Arnold Shashua and myself, I would like to thank the Jerusalem Post for recognizing us with Life Saving Technology Award. It is very important for us. The award is, of course, for the entire mobile team as well. Without them, we wouldn't be here today. You know, Amnon and I started Mobilize 17 years ago. We had the vision to solve one of the most difficult and unresolved problems, which is traffic accidents. In the modern world, it has become a real epidemic. Did you know that every year there are 1.5 million fatalities due to traffic accidents? And on top of it, around 50 million are injured. These numbers are staggering. Just to give you a perspective, the 1.5 million fatalities is equivalent to those from worldwide armed conflicts in the last 15 years combined. And if this figure is not shocking you enough, traffic accidents cost around 500 billion every year. Today, there are more than 10 million cars using mobile technology driving on roads worldwide. According to statistics that we already know, with this amount of vehicles equipped with mobile technology, most probably we saved 2,000 lives so far and prevented prevented more than 150,000 people from getting injured. And this is just a tiny fraction from the 2 billion vehicles driving on the roads. So just imagine what our world would look like if hundreds of millions of vehicles were equipped with our system. Today, Mobila is the leading supplier in the field that we call ADAS, Advanced Driver Assistance Systems. We work with the majority of the automakers worldwide, and we provide the full suite of applications, starting from lane departure warning, through auto braking for vehicles and pedestrians, and up to semi-autonomous and autonomous driving. The momentum that drives implementation of these systems is government regulation. And indeed, a few years ago, most of the developed countries started first steps of enforcing regulation. It started in Europe, then Japan, Korea, United States, and in Israel. In fact, in Israel, the government took an even bolder approach, led by the Ministry of Transportation, under the leadership of Minister Israel Katz. <laughs> yes. They created regulation which mandate existing vehicles as, as well, not just new vehicles, to install life-saving technology. And I believe that Israel is going to be an example to the world how government initiative can effectively, effectively fight traffic accidents. The effectiveness of these systems has been proven statistically. They prevent between 40 to 80% of car accidents. Very substantial numbers. But we are on the verge of much bigger evolution. 
Mobilize is deeply involved in developing and implementing semi-autonomous and autonomous driving. The idea is to take us, the drivers, out of the loop. We are responsible for 93% of car accidents. So once majority of the cars will be fully autonomous, we can expect close to zero traffic accidents. Due to sophistication of autonomous driving, we at Mobilite divided the implementation to three major steps. The first one is already commercially available, and few automakers already sell the system, which is autopilot. So with the drivers, we push a button. The vehicle keeps itself automatically within the lanes, keeps the right distance from the vehicle ahead, read the traffic signs and adapt the speed, speed accordingly, or based on traffic lights, so essentially fully autonomous on highway. The second step, which is 2018, we are about to extend the technology to include country roads and city roads. Once city roads are covered, we will start to see more and more cities which will define closed area where private cars will not be allowed to enter anymore. So all the transportation in this area will be driverless, most probably shared mobility. And then more and more cities will join to this effort. The third step is 2021. In our field, it's like tomorrow. First automaker is going to launch, based on our technology, fully autonomous vehicle that will take us from A to B. And this is very exciting. I don't see excitement here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how many of you are aware, but we are in the midst of the largest revolution in the automotive industry in the last 100 years. And we at Mobileye are lucky to be at the center of this huge transformation, which I believe will leave tremendously positive impact on our society. But what makes us even more proud, that this is another Israeli technological breakthrough which influences mankind so significantly by saving so many lives. So definitely, it is a great honor for us to receive this prestigious award. And let us remember some wise words from Albert Einstein. Strive not to be a success, but rather to be of value. Thank you.